You might have heard of this new harmonics project called Rock Band Blitz. You might be thinking, it kind of looks just like Rock Band Unplugged for the PSP, that DS one. And you might be saying, this thing I'm looking at right now looks suspiciously like a low-res Rock Band Blitz. All of those things are true. Back before Red Octane had to unload a pile of old Guitar Freaks controllers and needed some sort of N.A. kosher framing device for same, Harmonix cut their teeth pioneering the wild and woolly world of PS2 networking. But whatever that was worth. But back in those days, you didn't need plastic instruments to have a good time. It was perfectly acceptable to rock without a band. Isn't that right, Run DMC? I thought so. Amplitude is the sequel to Frequency, funny how that works, and ditches its predecessor's roundabout layout in favor of six tracks side by side by... stop that. Anyway, in the style of its predecessor, each track has sequences of targets in left, center, and right hand positions, actuated by hitting either the square, triangle, and circle keys, or, if you're ready to play in the big leagues, the L1, R1, and R2 buttons. Yes, I realize that that second control scheme seems more counterintuitive, but trust me, you're gonna want three dedicated fingers when this game gets up to speed. There are four difficulties and 26 tracks in total, ranging from rap to rock to whatever blippy beats the Duke of Insert Confection here was cooking up at the time. You'll recognize the names, Blink-182, Weezer, Slipknot, Garbage Pink, Freeze Pop, and just so that I can obligate my Aunt Jane to watch this video, David Bowie. The visual style is a drastic attempt at Synthesia, but if you're actually playing the game, you're gonna notice little to none of it. That is, unless you're all hopped up on the rhythm and you hit a freestyler and launch into the air as a being of pure musical energy and large numbers pop up everywhere. If you've really got the groove in your trousers, you can even remix the tracks to your own ends just like in Frequency. Also featured are a jukebox mode where you can, as assumed, just listen to the bleeding tracks an online multiplayer which is irrelevant as of 2007. With the game itself, this track-traveling, gem-blasting Technicolor fantasy will never die. It just gets painted over with some more rock. And the occasional roll. Or biscuit. Biscuits are fine too. Perhaps a scone. 